And that was a very stellar play. Great to kind of bolster that defense instead of being offensively zoned and go from there. But we're going to go into a SoCal Classic, man. We're going to have... Fallen versus Void, CLG Void. Yeah, CLG Void coming in here. And I mean, this is a. Uh, I'm not. I honestly don't know too many things about Rosalina. Definitely a character I have not seen too much in the tournament scene or played against or played as. Yeah. And uh, I, don't, I, I don't know if Fallen is like set. I, I, I believe he's not really set on a main yet. Um, I feel like he's playing Rosa more so just because he's uh, comfortable with the character yep. main dur during Smash 4. Mm -hmm. um, I know he's also playing Palutena as well. Um, but yeah, Void really finding a spot that he just, like, uh, for a character he really likes. He really likes Pichu, and he, he he's going to commit to the character. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. And I feel like the character fits him very nicely. Of course, we've all known Void to be someone who plays a lot of glass cannons. Yes, so, yes. Uh, he wants to mess you yep, up. <laughs> absolutely. He wants to run you down and make sure that you don't get a play. Yeah, and right now... Both of these players going at it right now. Void sending Fallen off stage. Rosalina has a really far recovery, but that uh, air dodge not gonna let Fallen have to use that up. You know, yes. and, and that's so great about um, so many characters that had those linear recoveries. I mean, Rosa definitely not one of them. Ooh, but the Ooh, back they're gonna uh, close it out. But yeah, it's just so much mix up options yes. off stage. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Oh, so, okay. there's pressure. Where have, are you gonna go though? Up. Oh, I'm not gonna be gonna roll there. <laughs> that sandwich game though. Absolutely. Oh, there it is. <laughs> that's so funny. And I mean. Fallen definitely known in the previous iteration of this game as the puppet master. He loves to do all these desyncs. Right. He likes to send out Luma and do all these little tricks. And he's a very fun Rosalina player to watch for sure. Oh, yeah, absolutely. You know, it's very Ooh, interesting too, man. Oh, smash. speaking of sandwich. Ooh. Yeah. I mean, when you're, when you're caught between the, the princess and the star, man, there, yep. there's not a lot of places to go. Yep. And again, um, Fallen, now he's got uh, uh, Luma synced in, sends, him right, sends her right back out. Yeah. And Nair, definitely Ooh, one of the bigger catch. changes. And wow, look at this combo game right now. Fallen is putting on a show, almost bringing it right back. Yeah, beautiful stuff here, man. <laughs> yeah. Boy trying to kick that Rosa nope. or that Luma <laughs> yeah, out of yeah, here. Yeah, get that out of here. <laughs> Please, yep. I don't want to deal with this star. Nope. Oh, and the forwarder not going to get that last hit. Dash that, going to catch that landing here. Fallen, oh, oh I thought anything. maybe oh, a gosh. smash attack was coming. Oh, is that is that a dead Luma? Yes, it is. Oh, and what's and the punish here? Get up, smash. Oh, tries to catch him stock. with the thunder. Yeah, so close. Oh, gets the drag down. Wow, oh. a setup? And just a toe. Dang. That was definitely a setup. Did not get, I mean, and we did see Captain L uh, have a tweet with the uh, lightning loops. Yes. So maybe Void experimenting with that drag down back air into, uh, you know, insert move. And yep. right there, that forward tilt definitely going to seal it out for him. Now, right now, uh, Fallen trying to get this corner pressure going, but Void oh, finds his way in. Oh, a mix up, so you got to attack that. Yeah, this character, when, uh, when Pichu gets damaged or yep. gets in, the damage is coming. Uh, the edge guarding and the ledge trap is also insane for this character. Like you said, man, just like that ultimate glass cannon you yes. are the you're so light but you're so tiny and nimble so you're yep. hard to hit oh, oh yeah. and the back and the air damage and the power and that is going to be game one for clg boys yeah beat you out here man yep just fresh out the egg yep. going against all these crazy fighters <laughs> but he's hit, he hits hard man yep oh man yeah that was absolutely crazy so it's interesting uh i feel that fallen is one of those people that is at a crossroads with this uh, game. Yeah. Uh, you know, obviously it's very early in the game. Uh, yeah, a lot of these top players don't really know who they're going to commit their time mm -hmm. into. Even Zero doesn't even have a main. No, yet. absolutely. It's like really hard to pick one. There's there's so many fun characters. Yep. There's so many characters, period. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like, man, everyone's here, dude. Yeah, no, absolutely, man, absolutely. Um, he actually doesn't, he's not really uh, big on the, uh, on a lot of the like attack cancel stuff. Mm -hmm. So that uh, a lot of the stuff can, uh, is very viable. Okay. Um, the stuff that he's known beforehand, uh, of course, again, being a puppeteer like himself, that's yes. something that he had discovered very, very early on. Uh, but nonetheless, he just feels like it's not as amazing as a lot of people have been talking about. And uh, I think he's found kind of strategies against it. I would like to see him utilize that stuff right now, though, because, again, people still don't know what yeah. to do. You got to I mean, use this that tech stuff, just man. got discovered recently, so you can abuse the fact that not everyone might not know how to DI against right. it. Absolutely. Okay, there's the up airs coming in, but the back air. No, I, I feel like Luma does a really good job when Rose is getting hit. Like, oh, let me just uh, get out of the way real quick. Yep. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, hold on. <laughs> I don't want to get caught up. Nope. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Ooh, there's a fair. Wow, very meaty aerial there. Going to catch Void. And right now, no Luma, but Fallen's still applying that, applying that pressure. Yep, absolutely. Fallen's waiting for that Luma to come in, but Void getting his opening. But here comes Luma back online. Yep. Oh, he's going to go for a high recovery. Mm -hmm. Good play. He's going to eat minimal damage here. Oh. Finally get back to the ground, but toss right so up side. 
Yeah. Absolutely. Man. I've seen so many uh, people get hit by that backside of the up smash. Yep. And Pichu's just so tiny and nimble that he can avoid so many attacks just by how short the character is. Absolutely. There's that forward tilt, and that does hit below the ledge, so you have to make a choice. Um, Pichu is definitely a character that puts you in those pressure situations. No punish from falling, though, on that yep. high recovery. Yeah, he's going to have to get away with that. Good jab there on the side. I love that. Going to cover all those options, that Luma. Oh, wow. Oh, and dipping right through all those options there. Yeah, the parry man. is going to get punished, though. Yeah, had that up smash, unfortunately, going to get that whiff. And the Fallen's going to make it back and on the side of the stage. Potential chaser, edge guard, not going to get it. Here comes Void. Yeah, and I, I feel like the only meaty hitbox that Rosa has without Luma to really close out the stock is Ooh. up smash, but not even going to let Fallen back on stage to go for that. Right now, Void getting the first stock. Yeah, oh my gosh, Ooh. and that Lunar Landing, so nice. Yeah, Lunar Landing, still a thing in this game, so um, Rosa just inputting that aerial right before she hits the ground, but uh, she doesn't really do her aerial because she's so close to the ground, but Luma follows through, man. Yep. And right there we oh. saw Fallen go ahead and close out that first stock, really good stuff. Again, Pichu trying to get in. Usually kind of want to approach with those uh, Thunder Jolts. Yeah. Very good approaching tool. And Pichu has really good air mobility. Oh! oh. <laughs> okay, Void. Uh, I'm just trying to tell him how you, you know, trying to get how in on these it, people, dude. man. But uh, <laughs> Void like out here it. saying, hey, man, uh, I'm already in. C could you speed it up? And I'm edge guarding. Uh, yep. <laughs> keep up, bro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and right now, Void still getting in on this Rosalina. 26% already, and he still has those two stocks. The Luma doesn't get closed out. Fallen getting a hit, relieving some of this pressure. Yeah, absolutely. And that's something that we really need to see from Fallen because right now, oh, good catch. Not going to wow. be a kill, though. Oh, dang. Luma's, Luma's out there. <laughs> yes, absolutely. So that's one of the things that Luna, in that kind of situation, you can go ahead and put Luma out there. And literally, it will just drag the character down if you get attached with that. Yeah, so that's something you do have to be careful about. But again, being so nimble. Yes, he went he weaved crazy. right he around, around it. Yeah. that up smash. And he, it was crazy. He weaved right in between Rosa and Luma. But Fallen's still going to find that up smash eventually and going to take that stock from Void. One stock apiece here. Waits for the directional air yep. dodge. Fallen Gosh. still can do this. The Luma's right back online. This is a fresh Luma. Oh, what's yep. the reversal here? Do. Yep, can you back on stage from there. Yeah, and a lot of people didn't like the Nair change at first, right. but it looks like a pretty solid move, not going to lie. Yeah. Absolutely. It's a wide arc. Oh, but oh the back air, is that enough? Oh, Whew. so close. Yeah, that man. was really close. Yeah, and Rosa is so, so light, man. And this is going to be the hardship. They're trying to go for again at oh. two frame. And that forward tilt gets rid of Luma. So That's quickly. a pretty early Luma kill right there. Yep. Fallen is at very high percents. No Luma. Back air going to send him in a very not good situation here. Off stage, directional air dodge to the oh, ledge. Doesn't no. work out. Oh, That's, That's unfortunate, yeah. man. He Not wanted to go the for ledge. the ledge. Yes, yeah, of and course. He might have still been able to make it back, but it would have been so close. Yeah. There's so much lag on that directional air absolutely, dodge. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah, yeah unfortunate for falling there. I, I didn't see a red spark. Maybe you could have teched. Maybe, but yeah, he, he was pretty was high checkable. percent. Yeah. Um, I, I believe he got hit by the sour hit of that uh, Pichu Nair. Maybe right. just didn't really expect it. Maybe yeah. he thought he was going to go for a bear or something, uh, right. something else. But yeah, uh, yeah you, you got to be able to react and get that tech on point. But man, Fallen, that game number two, I definitely saw the adaptations from Fallen. Yes, I definitely can absolutely. see this um, game, this next game going to his favor. I feel like, I don't know if he practices with the Pichu, but definitely there's some things that now he's starting to apply in this game number two, and yep. that's really quick. And these top players, they adapt really quick. Yeah, man, and I'm really, it's really incredible to kind of see that adaptation. I think one of the th main things I'm seeing is Fallen is definitely adapting in terms of neutral. Yes. He's just really having a hard time maintaining that advantage state, and that's something that's so important in this game. Yes. Uh, obviously in Smash 4, you can kind of sit back more so, just get a little damage here and there. But now, with a, especially going up a cantry like Pichu, where Boy gets a hit, you know he's going 0 to 80. You know he's going 0 oh, to yeah. 60. You know, if you're and at 80%, get you off that's stage. a kill. Yeah. And I like this. Fallen is using a lot more um, low back airs, mm -hmm. a lot more down smash. Right. To catch this very small and short character, he's using all these hitboxes that hit really low to the ground. Yeah, absolutely. And that adaptation coming out from Fallen, really, really good. He's up 40%, but he's got to get out of this situation. He does get back on stage and the Luma to follow with him, too. Absolutely, man. Beautiful timing there, man, on that beat. That was really quintessential. You saw Void trying to go there for the kill. He's like, I'm not going to let that happen. And again, just... Hacking the damage bit by bit there on Fallen side. Wow, Void going Ooh. for the kill there. That thunder is very, very strong. Pichu uh, doesn't really know how to control his thunder attack, so he does damage himself when yep. he's doing them, but they're extremely powerful because he just doesn't know how much kick he has. Yeah, absolutely, <laughs> man. Okay, the Nair is going to cover that ledge jump. Yep. Fallen, no directional air dodge. Just going to sink and go with the up B here. I like all the mix-ups coming out from Fallen on these recoveries. Yep, absolutely. Very, very good catch. I think it's been throwing off. Boy, just enough so he hasn't been able to get the two frame. 
Gets a down tilt there, though. These forward tilts are so, so strong, man. Yeah, it's so good. Yeah, and he's even using them to kill Luma as well. Oh, the sidestep. Yeah. Okay, but he snatches up the Pichu. Throws Back it off stage. Throw. Dang, almost killed mm, from yeah. center stage. Not yet. Goes for a down tilt. And they get that two from Doesn't get it, but the okay. full jab. Oh, yeah. you are gone. Definitely. See ya. Like, that was teleportation yep. right there. <laughs> Instant transmission, man. <laughs> <laughs> and it, it's so crazy because... Time and time again, everyone's saying like, oh yeah, Pichu's so light, it's so hard to, you know, just get past the 60% sometimes right. with Pichu, but Void is that, you know, he is a top player, he knows how to use how nimble the character is to survive really long, and more times than not, I see Void living like past 150 with this character. No, absolutely, and because this is one of the main things, right? Because he's moving so fast, in order to tag him, you feel like you gotta use a fast move. Exactly. A lot of fast moves are not gonna be all too strong, right? Exactly. And yep. so, again, he's gonna be living because he's just getting hit by a little stray hits here and there. Yep. So really great stuff by Void to keep mobile and avoid a lot of those kill options. Wow, this Nair looking like a really good juggle tool and up air as well. Fallen doing a really good job this game. Number three, the Luma is on deck as well. Man, that move just quick. Yeah. Oh, but the cross-ups are quick yeah. as well. Luma could catch up air. Here's a juggle situation. Something that we really haven't seen so far from Fallen up until this game. Oh, I like their Void just kind of stalling out. Like, I'm not going to commit to kill your Luma just yet. Um, Fallen kind of respecting him a little bit there and not going to save the Luma. But right now, Void is trying to pull oh, out a clip. Oh, wow. The backside okay. of up Th That was cute. That yeah. was cute. <laughs> and he, you saw the walk Yeah, the walk away. back. Yeah. yeah, that was so smart. He was like, all right, Void, you want to kind, you want to come? Oh, oh no. no. And Fallen was doing such a good job exactly. there, too. I, I can still see him. Nailing out this stock, it is even, but man, he had such a good lead, and I, I really like the play that got him that lead as well. Yeah, he just repositioned here. himself with the very little bit of space he had, and he got that up smash with the reverse side as well. Yeah, and I love that. It almost felt like he was just like, okay, I'm going to walk Ooh. away, and if he presses a button here, then I can up smash. The reverse up smash will kill. Really, really great stuff. But man, this is kind of rough now, man. Oh, that did loss? he get hit by the spike? No, he's going to be all right. Oh, the Ooh. reverse up air, though. Yep. Wow, very uh, very sneaky coming out from Void here. Yeah, absolutely, man. Ooh, but the pivot grab, going to catch that landing there. Fallen still doing a really good job. Pretty much, and he still has the lead here. Yep. I, I like how he's pressuring with neutral air, too. It's, it's a very different pressure style of Rosalina absolutely. from the previous game. Yeah. So it's very, uh, very interesting to see. And it's I think it helps him, like, he kind of chase some of these landings, too. So I think that's really nice about it, rather than just going instantly up in the air with up air and potentially uh, putting himself in disadvantage. Yeah. And like like you said right there, uh, Fallen went for the uh, down smash, but boy, just so quick, so nimble, just got out of the way, got the punish here. Now Fallen trying to get back on stage. He, he does get back on stage, but where's the Luma? Oh, the Luma's just flying. Yeah. <laughs> like, where? Luma's like, get me away from that beach, <laughs> yeah. man. Yeah. Oh, but the oh Luma is going to fall there. The forward tilt, not going to catch the two frame. The yep. get up attack, dang. Rose has got the long leg, man. Absolutely. Oh. Is backer going to be it, though? And yes, it is. And just like that, another 3-0 outside of Ally and Fatality.